I'm really excited by AI and I'm also not afraid of it taking my job. <laughs> if you use AI, it doesn't mean it's replacing people. So it's allowing us to become almost editors rather than creators. I am not sure who else feels this way, but when I look at a blank piece of paper, my brain does not do great. <laughs> but if I see something that's already there, I can edit quickly and I can just start building on top of it. I'm using it to save me time. So it's going to reduce the amount of labor that's required to do something just like technology has always done, right? Now you have a lot of leverage and so it takes less labor, but now the labor has moved to other purposes. Now I'm using it to augment my abilities and it's certainly not going to replace your personal experiences and the stories that you've got. The way that we're using this internally at SuccessWise is we're using AI to generate a blank slate and then we're going in, we're adding our own stories. We're using the psychology we know that's really effective in, in copywriting. We're using a lot of those things that we've learned from Dan Kennedy, the greats of copywriting, and we're fitting that in to what AI has already created. So I've just gone ahead and added in what is the difference between inbound and outbound marketing? I haven't pressed go, I haven't pressed anything. You're gonna see this in real time, create <laughs> an answer that you can use. We don't wanna just produce AI regulated content, right? We want to use this as a base, add our own stories, add in those psychology tricks. This is a perfectly written response about the difference between inbound and outbound marketing. Now, if you are in a hyper niche area, it will be harder for it to write the correct stuff. So you have to make sure that they're actually talking about correct information. But I definitely think this is a really exciting tool that we're gonna be able to harness.